Our first speaker is primetime Emmy award-winning actress, Golden Globe nominee and NAACP Image Award winner many times over. She's known for her roles in The Women, Madea's Family Reunion, and The Josephine Baker Story, where she starred as the incomparable Josephine Baker. Please help us welcome to this stage an incomparable individual in her own right, Lynn Winfield. So Martin Lawrence, well, you know, in that incredible filmography, they did not mention our film, Thin Line Between Love and Hate. Thank you. To which I must say, I have never had so much encouragement to be a crazy, you know what. But this man, encouraged all women to Sheena's here. What I want to thank him for, you know, there was a scene in Thin Line Between Love and Hate where I stood with the instrument in his mouth and said, I'm not doing this for myself. I'm doing it for all women. So right now, I want to thank all women. I want to thank you on behalf of all women, Martin, for always presenting women as strong, for always allowing us to speak our mind, for always allowing us to be glamorous and fabulous and strong and whoop some butt when we felt like it. I want to thank you for that. Thank you so much because many men in entertainment are not courageous enough to let us be our strong, full-blown selves as women, and you encourage it. I thank you for that. I want to thank him for being such a gentleman I want to thank him for being such a loyal friend through the good times, through the bad times. He's always there. He always has an ear. I remember when we were shooting Thin Line, he was working on one of those road, one of his comedy tours at the time. He was working on an album at the time. He was just married at the time. His wife was pregnant at the time. He was directing a film and giving a brilliant performance. So he multi and running his show and getting all the scripts ready for your next season. So I'm telling you, I saw him a few months ago. We were working together and he said, "Ooh, I'm getting old. I said, no, you're just tired because you've done so damn much. Because you changed the fabric of American culture. Because before Tyler, before anyone, he presented us as we know ourselves and made us love ourselves and made us laugh at ourselves and laugh with ourselves. And I just say, honey, if you want these people walking all over your name, fine. But I want to tell you, you are in the stars in the heavens forever for everything you've done for everyone. I love you. 